Howdy folks, Bad Mark with Mac Tech here, just bringing you a quick video. Today I wanted to review these new keycap sets by Akko. Now, in the past, I have been a big fan of Akko keycaps. I think that their packaging, for one, being in the metallic ma magnetic case um, with a stud for every single key and the keycap holder as well, I think that's magnificent. It's better than GMK. I just, you can't argue that. GMK comes in plastic or styrofoam. Akko, for its price and its value, great. So now they have the ASA Profile keycap set, which is their version of the SA Profile, which seems to be becoming very popular as of late. I certainly like them. I love the sound that they make. And I get a little frustrated when people say, oh, keycaps don't really make that much of a difference to the sound of the keyboard. <sighs> yes, they do. Keycaps do make a difference in the sound of the keyboard. And I intend to do a test with several similar keyboards or basically the same modified keyboards with different keycaps and the same switches. Um, that's one of the many videos I have planned. I just have not had time. So I appreciate your guys' patience with me in the last week or so as I haven't been able to put out any content at all. I've been doing some housework, uh, basically some remodeling. So anyway, today we're taking a look at SAL profile. So this is a new profile that Akko came up with. Now, the first thing I noticed when I received this was the fact that this is, I was, I was waiting it for it to be a little heavier because I was expecting for there to be inside of here a metal case, but I was sorely mistaken. So right off the bat, I'm kind of like, why are you downgrading, Akko? Are you guys trying to save money? Now I did this, I did get this, I had a discount. So I got uh, this set, I want to say, shipped for $30. $8. I, I'll correct if that's not, I, I don't remember. Um, but looking at it, first thing first I see is, now these are ABS. Their other keycaps are PVT. So let's keep that in mind while we do, you know, look at these. But the fact that these come in plastic trays, right off the bat kind of made me go, why? So this is a very clean black on white set and, and has plenty of keys as well as some animal um, novelty keys, keys there. The legends, they are pretty crisp, I must say. The letters are quite big, which I am a fan of. Um, I would prefer that they would have stayed in the same case um, when it come, came to the legends, but no. Capital E. Yes, SC. And in the back, we can see the tooling marks, but that looks like it's been cleanly cut off. And we can see that it is a, a double shot key. Now, if we go ahead and break out the uh, caliper here to see, we're looking at about 1.9 millimeters of thickness. On We just grabbed the escape key. So the feeling of these keys are actually quite nice. Also, looking at the profile, it's very similar, but does not seem quite as sculpted to me as the... Um, either SA or ASA, I could be wrong, but just off of looking up at it right here. So, I'm not sure if I, honestly, I'm honestly not sure if I like this font. I like it bigger, but I don't know if you guys can see this, but it's, it's very, very close to Comic Sans. I mean, it's not, but it looks, I don't know. I like my legends to be more crisp and sharp, and this is more of a rounder type font. So I, I, I'm, I, so far I'm not very impressed. Now I wanted to go ahead and just for comparison, pull up you know, a regular Akko set. And this is the Akko Wave. And as I said, this is the, I am used to Akko keycaps coming in, a nice magnetic case with a slot for every key. Now this is the, ASA profile. So let's take the escape key from this set and the escape key from this set and take a look at them side by side. All right. So see, this is what I'm talking about. This is a much better. Oh, let me see if I can see how this are all caps. That's nice. This, this is not. 
I don't like it. I don't know if anybody else out there likes it, but it seems like a word that got cut off. So now if we flip these over, we're going to see that, oh, I've got O-rings on these. What are the difference in the thicknesses? So if we look at the PBT, oh, 1.4, 1. 1. oh, wait a minute. Yep, 1.4. So let's take this back out to the, oh, I went too deep there. Oh, let me reset it. 1.6, yeah, 1.6, 1.5. So they are slightly thicker. Uh, obviously, it is ABS. So on the long term, though, I'm curious because it is double shot, so they should be fine, but will they shine? Um, so I'm not a fan of the Legends, and I am not a fan of the packaging so far. I, uh, no, I wanted to compare the height of these to see how closely they align. So we look at these side by side. Oh, wow. Okay, so we can see that the SAL cap is much taller than the ASA um, by a good amount. Wow. Yeah, that's a, that's a difference there. That's a couple millimeters at least in height difference. So these SAL are closer to an OEM, I would guess, than an ASA from their previous one. I also want to go ahead and, I mean, I know these are ABS and I'm comparing to P PBT compacts, but as far as quality ones, these are what I have available to me right now. Let's take a look and compare these with another set of quality keycaps, which are these. These are MT3. Now, um, I don't know if you guys have heard of all of the drama around MT3, but I uh, actually plan to write a blog article about it here in the future. So these are this is a very nice set. I, I'm a big fan of the MT3 profile. But let's go ahead and take out a key out of here. See, now there, you can see how much more sculpted that keycap is, but it looks like this one actually comes close to matching. The, oh, look at that. The MT3 keycap set is actually taller by a, by a pinch. Just by a hair, but it is taller by a pinch to the... Well, actually, you can see it better there. Line them up. You can see how the... Um, so, okay, it just does have a sculpt. This one has more of a kind of like a scoop. This one's kind of sculpted, and this one has more of a scoop. So there's definitely a difference. That I do love the sound these keycaps make. They can turn almost any board, well, any good tuned board, into a Thaki board very easily. So that's with, in comparison to the Susu Watati uh, set from MT3, and a company whose name I will not mention anymore, because I will not be shopping with them anymore. All right, and then I wanted to compare I found these on eBay not too long ago. Uh, this set was actually 20 bucks. It's an SA profile, but they're almost uniform uh, in uh, in size. There's a very, very small. So even though they're called SA, I don't know if they would be necessarily SA. Now, these are, um, from the description, ABS. And they're double shot. They actually look... Uh, quite good and they sound pretty good as well for $20 I was actually surprised although some of the legends on these are not that great they didn't get printed well so but for 20 bucks I mean not much to complain about there so but compared again let's go ahead and grab the F1 key so this is the SA profile next to the SAL profile as you can see we we are looking at almost Exact similarity. Oh. Of course, I would go and drop it. Mm. These keycaps, as far as profile goes, are extremely similar. If we look at the side, well, now the SAL does stick out a little bit more on the front, and it seems to be a little less convex than this, but 
the similarities are definitely there. There's a little bit more surface, it seems to be, on this one. But, yeah, there's a, there's a lot of similarity between these two. So, I will get to some more reviewing of this. I'll put the, this keycap set on a board, see how they look and see how they sound. Um, but so far, I am, I'm not very, uh, just not very pleased. I believe this set sells normally for $49.99. Uh, but it's the same price that their other keycap sets came in. But it's in a box and it's in plastic. And I think they messed up the legends. So <sighs> I'm I'm sorely disappointed. I'll, I'll just be honest. I'll just put it that way. I, I, I thought I'd really enjoy this keycap set. But see, because look at this. This is... This is what I'm talking about. Why? Why are you doing this, Akko? Look at this. That's the proper way to do a legend. See how it's all uppercase? Why have you mixed this up with this? I mean, that's that's a deal breaker. I'm, I'm going to go ahead and start a return. I will not be doing any further videos with these keycaps. This is, this is, this is a mess. Who designed this? Who thought that putting mixing cap mixing case with your different i mean I, I i i don't get it i, I what oh somebody came along at the last one and said hey we forgot the macintosh keys but make sure to put those in all caps and completely just did not look at the rest of the key caps i mean this is Akko, this is this is just this is awful this is awful so you have control there control command opt so wait a minute so only the macintosh keys are going to be capitalized but all the rest of them are not so any it doesn't matter what board i use this on it's just not going to match it's not going to work so i think akko you guys you guys failed here you guys seriously failed i'm starting a return with these i'm done it's not not worth it not for the price even with the discount i'm not even going to bother to put these any keyboard i'm sorely disappointed Akko. well those are my thoughts for the day i hope that's a little bit of filler for right now like i said i'm working on production and everything else but i gotta get through some home renovations at the moment so i appreciate everyone's patience keep calm keyboard on